What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to automatically wipe your phone if it ever falls into the wrong hands. Now normally, if you have a PIN or password lock on your Android device, you get 5 attempts to enter the correct passcode before you get locked out. The trouble here is after 30 seconds of being locked out, you get 5 more attempts. So if your phone is ever stolen, the thief gets quite a few tries at hacking your password. And if they end up succeeding eventually, they'll get access to all the sensitive data that's stored on your device. This is why developer Zygote Labs created the app Locker. It allows you to set a limit on failed password or PIN attempts. And when this number is reached, the device automatically performs a factory reset. You can download the app for free on Google Play, so go ahead and get it installed and we'll check out the setup process. Now the first thing to do here is tick this box next to Admin Enabled. When you do that, Locker will ask your permission to become a device administrator. Go ahead and hit Activate here. And next, use this slider to determine how many failed attempts you want to allow before the device wipes itself. And when you've got that all sorted out, go ahead and tap this Enable button at the bottom of the screen. At this point, Locker is all set up, so let me demonstrate the wiping process. As far as the secure lock screen interface goes, nothing has changed here. You can put in your PIN number, just like you normally would, and everything will go off without a hitch. But if someone else got a hold of your device, the first thing they'll probably do is type in a random PIN and see if they can get lucky. But when they've reached the limit of failed attempts that you set up, the phone automatically shuts down. And it's not just shutting down, it's actually booting into recovery to perform a hard reset. This should work with stock recovery as well as any custom recovery that supports open recovery scripts. So now, your data has been wiped and there's nothing left on this device to use for identity theft or fraud. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.